Hello amigos, this is level 12 and today I just want to give a quick trigger warning. This video will feature um, Nazi art, uh, Italia, Nazi fan art, concentration art. It, I'm gonna go through this video really quickly because I've made it so many times and I'm so conflicted about this issue and my nerves, like my hands feel so weird. They feel like when I'm having panic attacks, which I'm not, but <laughs> they feel that way. Um, so. I want to discuss when an Italian artist goes too far, question mark, because there's so many sides to this debate and I'm so conflicted on how I feel. I, I, I feel disgusted, like I know I feel that, but I'm like, how do I feel about the person behind this winch? I've gone back and forth and I've officially decided I'm not going to name drop who this is. You might be able to tell from the art style, but I'm going to block uh, any comments that mention her name because she's currently under a lot of fire right now. and she doesn't deserve all of it. She deserves to be called out and critiqued, but to this extent to get like spammed over and over again with random crap is just, it ain't it fam. So this is the art that was posted. Um, as you can see, it's Germany in an SS uniform. Some people claimed uh, that it was romanticizing or glorifying Nazism because of the way Germany's drawn. He's drawn looking with a s smile, uh, crazy eyes, intense lighting, uh, and as you can clearly see there is the armband on his arm, the, the the red one, without the swastika mind you, but it's the armband, and this was posted for a friend, you know, or well this was made for a friend and she was, she just decided to post it, cause you know, content. Other than the fact that this is Nazi Germany art, which puts me off because I'm like, hmm, I don't, I don't think I want that in the Hidalgo community. If that wasn't enough, she put in the dis in the caption, I wonder how long this will take to be taken down, or something to that effect. Again, not, I didn't get that part uh, verbatim, but, and it's just, it, 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 as Creamy Maple said, it leaves a bitter taste in the mouth, and it's off-putting. Like, why, why would you do that? Why? Okay, what? It, you're entitled to make the art you want, okay? I can't stop you from making whatever art you want, but I can say when it's distasteful and just kind of out of line, and she's Polish, and a bunch of people were like, well, she's Polish, so she obviously understands the implications and she must be okay with it, or something, something like that. Again, I'm not Polish, so that was an entire debate on the Polish side of Instagram, and some of it wasn't in English, so I couldn't fully decipher it, but... Um, in any event, uh, a lot of people were just like, there were, there were people from all ends of the spectrum. Some people being like, hey, this is wrong, you shouldn't have posted this, this is very, you know, insensitive. And then some people were like, you know, this is fine, it's just art, it doesn't matter, it doesn't mean anything. It's, it, some people went as far to say, this is a show about World War II, what do you expect when in the show Germany hardly ever, I've only ever seen them once wear the black uniform, and even then it was without the armband. Um, it's just, it, it's, it's very weird, it's very controversial, and I, 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 I just wish it wasn't posted. I wish there had been enough fort, forethought to understand that the Italia fandom does not want this on the internet. We don't want to see that. Draw it for your friend, draw it for your own pleasure. We do not want to see that. So, she did eventually take the art down after people were commenting and telling her that she shouldn't have done that. I didn't personally see any comments that were harassing or bullying her. And by the way, I'm not here to cancel this artist. I'm not here to bully this artist or deplatform this artist. I just want to bring light to a situation that sparks a bigger conversation. So this is the first part of her um, apology and most of it, I don't, the, that first part I really don't have a problem with except for her intentions. I don't know what they were. They probably weren't malicious, but intentions mean nothing when the outcome is the same. The second part, she was like, I just had to use Germany because um, he represents every period of that time and he's that character. And I'm just like, you could have just drawn the clothes on a mannequin or a random character, not Germany. That's so tied to the Italia fandom. Some people just don't want to see that. And she's like, it's part of my AU. And then I'm like, well, what's your AU? And some people... And she said, uh, without any Nazi symbols, which is, to me, is a lie. Because we can clearly see the red armband, which to me is symbol enough. You may think otherwise, but to me that's symbol enough. And it's just, it's, it's off-putting. 
She also uh, said that she, she's she can't change the whole fandom, which I agree. Like, that's dumb. <laughs> like, she isn't going to bring another crusade on the Hitalia fandom. Like, that just ain't it. This last part is what really, like... It, it, I didn't like this last part. I think her apology would have been perfectly fine if she hadn't included this. Um, it says, Law says we can use Nazi symbols in art and education without any consequences, so actually I didn't do anything bad. No. What you did was morally gray. Um, it, what you did wasn't illegal, I feel like, is what you mean. Yes, you didn't do anything illegal. You didn't do anything against probably Instagram's terms of service, knowing how loosely they uh, take they enforce those rules but you did something morally reprehensible it's like why would you do that because some people are going to take offense to it because some people just don't want to see that on their feed and granted they follow you and i've scrolled through your page and it mostly isn't that it's mostly just gerb hole and uh, lit pole and you know just normal fluffy stuff now there's a debate be had on the gerb hole side but that that's neither here nor there um and again she said she did it without any badges or symbols, which that is a badge. I'm sorry to say either she's lying on purpose or she just, we're considering what a badge is two different things. Agree to disagree. Um, and she's like, I heard it's too sim sensitive topic for art. It's too controversial, offensive, and sensitive. But the problem is art is controversial, offensive, and sensitive sometimes. Yes, it can be, but usually it's for like political means or expressionism this is just you posting art of germany in an ss uniform which i feel like is offense which i feel like you didn't even mean to be offensive it's just happened to be offensive and you're like oh guess it's offensive art now and it's just it, it rubs me the wrong way this entire section and i just wish she hadn't included it because it makes her look totally bad art should be totally free thing it should have no borders that kind of art is also my favorite kind that's why i didn't say anything bad in posting my drawing i just treat art as a totally free medium where there's no words like too much and i can guarantee you there is too much in art um i can 100 percent guarantee you um also she's 15 so like maybe she doesn't fully understand the implications but part of me feels like a 15 year old should i don't i don't know there's a debate on that as well it's Again, I hate this situation. Um, I'm sorry if some of you didn't understand what I meant. I keep forgetting art in a non-art society is just beautiful landscapes. I'm sorry again. That, this, again, I dislike this entire part, but that kind of sent me. I'm just like, I understand art. Listen, honey, I was gonna go to an art school. It's, it's not the fact that this isn't some landscape. It's not some Monet painting. It's the fact that it's literally Germany in an SS uniform and you're very flippant about it. I think if you had contextualized it a little bit better or his expression was a little bit different or the lighting was different or just some things were changed, especially without the red armband, people would have less of a problem. There's small things you could have done to just fix this situation and I feel so bad for her because she did eventually like say sorry and apologize and whatever and I really hope she's learned from this um there's this there was a comment on her apology that said this post in the comments clearly show the worst and best side of the Italian fandom which it does it showed again people saying like hey you know your apology is cool or whatever but you still did what you did and you gotta own up to that and then some people were like you did nothing wrong honey you're fine and then there were some people that i absolutely hate like the one i blocked it says everyone has a creative outlet stick a fork in yours and i do not support that if you commented something like that out out the door i don't support that and if anyone does tell her that horrible shame on you but as I said before, she's a repeat offender. This isn't her first time posting something controversial, and this is your last trigger warning. This is will show concentration fan art. So this is Poland with a number on his arm, and she goes on to describe how she was super upset learning about Auschwitz and how no one in her class was as visibly upset as her, and I can empathize with her. I've learned about the Holocaust and I've cried over it, and it's been it's it's been a whirlwind of emotions, and it's just I empathize with her on that front. I just don't think this should have been posted necessarily. Like, it's vent art, it's emotional art, I get that, but it's also like, hmm, it's a little, 
It's a little questionable. I don't know. I just feel very weird seeing Poland with a concentration brand on his arm. Like, that just is very off-putting to me. Like, I don't think about Hitalia in that way, and I don't want to think about Hitalia in that way. And I've read historical fan fictions and stuff like that, and they've always been done with a very delicate hand to the sensitive subject matter, and I just, I just don't think this fits that mold. I just, it, it just, I don't, I don't know. This is the last bit of art. It's from an animation meme, and um, it basically shows Germany taking over the world, and then this just pops up, and I, I think this video would have been okay. Again, it's Germany in the black uniform with the red armband, and it's just, I don't, it feels very weird to me, and I feel icky when I look at it. It shocked me when I saw this. I couldn't believe this had been posted in a Italia animation meme, and I was, this is from three months ago, <laughs> and it's just, it's so weird and I feel like it's implied to be Poland because the let the numbers are the same and the triangle has a P on it. It's just it's off putting and I don't want to touch it because it makes me feel icky and gross and I just uh, I, I I don't know why she posts art like this. I really wish she wouldn't and I hope she just stops. Like I hope she just sticks to the regular fluffy art that she does. And maybe she wants to do darker art, but this really ain't it. She there are ways to do dark art. This ain't it. This really isn't it. So when does art cross the line? There's been a big debate about we only called out this person because mob mentality. And I've seen a lot of people say, well, you don't call out fascist Italy art. You don't call out Soviet Russia art. You don't call out imperialism Japan art. You don't call out Confederate America art. And listen, fam, if I did, I would call it out, okay? I don't see that. And it's, it's just... If I saw that kind of art, I would 100% call it out. It's not, it's not like I'm turning a blind eye, because some people implied that we turn a blind eye to that stuff because, oh, everyone hates Nazi Germany because we do. I don't like Stalin or Lenin Russia. I don't like Confederate America. I don't like fascist Italy. I don't like those things. But the thing is, I don't see it. I've never, well, I haven't seen it in recent times for me to call it out. I'm so conflicted, and art crosses the line when you make light of a very serious situation. When you're like glorifying, romanticizing like imperialism Japan and fascist Italy and Soviet Russia and Confederate America and those bad things, yes that's wrong, but <sighs> there's times and place for this kind of thing and I just don't think this is it. This entire situation was horrible. I don't think anyone, not even I, have a good are, are like in the right here. I think there's a lot of morally gray areas. There's a lot that needs to be fixed and I'm just, I feel concerned. I feel weird. It's just the situation makes me feel icky. My biggest concern in this entire situation is one, the artist's safety, because I'm super, super afraid. And again, there's been allegations coming against this artist and I will link those things below if you want to uh, find it in talk about it. I'm just here to talk about the art and I'm I don't want anyone to like hurt themselves over this and I'm super scared for the artist but I'm also scared for the Italia fandom because I don't want it to become toxic again. I was talking to some other people and they were like yeah this is really feeling like reminiscent of like 2010, 2012, 2016 Italia and I'm like oh no I, I can't, I don't want to be in that fandom. I don't want to be associated with that kind of dumpster fire. And I just, I want everyone to understand from this situation that this kind of art without proper context or being super flippant about it isn't like okay. And it needs to be done with a little bit more delicacy than this. Just give it the proper whatever that it needs. And I think you'd be a-okay. Other than that, I think that's it for this video. So if it, this is a very recognizable art style. This is a very popular person on Instagram and YouTube. But if I see her name in the comments, I'm going to be deleting them because it ain't, that ain't it. She deserves just a mental break right now and I really hope she gets it and I really hope she changes her behavior because this ain't it. And anyone else that either sends her death threats, harass her, tries to deplatform her, or draw 
art to the same horrible level like fascist Italy and Soviet Russia and those kind of things, you're on the same plane and I don't, I don't give you a pass for that. It's just I haven't seen it. Anyways, thank you for watching. Like and subscribe for more random fandom things. I really want to take an angry nap.